today we're gonna to be playing Batman on Game Boy. Ever since doing my video on the Batman NES game, I've been on a Batman kick. And I just discovered that this game existed. It's also made by Sunsoft, so I'm hoping it's good. Haven't played too much of it, so this is kind of a first impressions type of deal. Um, let's see how it is. Okay, so since this is a Game Boy game, I am using the Super Game Boy on a Super Nintendo just because I think it looks cool to have a border, and plus if I get frustrated I can take a break and I can change the border or draw on it or change the colors or just mess around. Because the Super Game Boy is awesome. So, alright, let's get going. Gotham City. So right away, I already noticed that just like the NES game, you're back in a factory. Except now Batman is really cute and tiny. And he has a gun. And is it just me or do those guys look like Dale Gribble from King of the Hill? I think it's because of the red hat that the Super Game Boy gives it. It's just to me, I'm like, okay, so there's like a bunch of like Ghostbuster looking Dales. Ooh. That was dumb. These little blocks remind me of Super Mario Land. Like, a lot. And then the dark- the darker blocks, those give you items. So that's kinda cool. And like I was saying, I haven't really played too much of this. Like, I've just done the first couple levels, so... So I might run into stuff that where I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing, and I'm playing like shit right now. Ooh, can I get up there? Cool. Aw oh, man. factory. What a surprise. <laughs> I'm just joking. I actually like that they kind of all take place in like chemical factories or just weird screwed up factories that are all fronts for evil doing. I have right now. Oh shoot. Because it's like bounce it's like bouncy bullets. <laughs> so whatever that's called. I don't like the bouncy bullet weapon because it sucks. Oh I was gonna plummet to my death. <laughs> okay, what the heck is that? I can't even make out what that is. Okay, well that sound didn't sound too good. Is it like the blue mushroom? That was dumb. Anyway, what I was saying, was it like the blue mushroom in Lost Levels or something where it's like a power up that just psychs you out and it really just hurts you. So that'd be messed up. That's not very nice. Sun soft. Whoa. I don't like how those robot things follow you. It's kind of frightening. One thing I also noticed, it's like, okay, so there's still, there's plenty of robots in this game also that I don't believe have anything to do with Batman. I mean, that's fine. If the game's good, it doesn't have to be like, you know, only Batman characters. Come on. Why aren't you, ah. All right, 
right. No! Cool, got a heart. More ill gribbles up here. funny if it was like in the second level of Mario Brothers and you could just like stay up there the whole time. That would be kind of cheap, huh? But then you'd be like, why am I watching this? She's not even really playing it. Ah! Robots! Sunsoft loves robots in their Batman games, huh? probably should have looked this up, but to be honest, I don't- I hate reading, like, manuals or, like, directions. <laughs> like, if I- if I get stuck, I'll look at something, but it's- I just hate it. I'm totally one of those people, so I apologize. Because I know that probably aggravates certain people. Factory. What a shocker! <laughs> you know what? Like, I don't. I say that like it's a bad thing, but it's totally fine. I like these messed up factories that Batman games take place in. Ah! It's a lot of robots. What even kind of robot is that? Almost looks like a crab made out of like a baguette or something. I don't, I don't know. Ooh, oh, hey, I didn't know you're gonna come back up. <sighs> Little bastard. That weapon's cool, but it's just like a drag to wait for it to come back to you. Okay, well that one got away from me. But, unlike the, um, what was I saying? Unlike the NES game when you have the battering, like, you just, like, even though it clearly comes back to you, it's still like, you know, you it, the weapons are limited, so you run out. So it's like, okay, that's kind of cool. Like in this one, it like actually works like a legit boomerang, battering, boomerang, battering, whatever. Whoa. Holy platforms, Batman. Oh my God. I don't like the robots that like jump on you. I don't like that. Speaking of jumping robots, does anyone know what Osmo is? <laughs> like at Disneyland, they, I mean, he's still there, but not really. Like they used to have a show where like they had Osimo the robot and he would like, he could run and like kick a soccer ball. And for some reason when he started running, I'm like, that's kind of terrifying. Like, think about it. Like if robots can run, what else are they capable of? <laughs> That'd be scary. If you saw a robot running at you, even if it was cute like Osimo, I, would, I wouldn't want to be there. I'd get the hell out of there. Come on. Damn it. Okay. I swear, trying to aim at those little blocks, like when you have to jump, it's so annoying. Okay, see, I'm a, I think those, I don't even know what that is. Well, whatever that power up is, pretty sure it hurts you, cause like, listen to the sound it makes. It doesn't sound like a good sound, but I don't know what it does. 
Once again, probably should have looked at the manual or looked up the power-ups, but what's the fun in that? Don't you just like going into things blind and making stupid mistakes? Someone in the comments will probably be like, it obviously does this. I'll be like, well. All right, Batman versus Jack. Let's go. Oh. That was dumb. Whoa. I don't like how he crouches down. It creeps me out. Like, I don't like that. I don't know why. Whoa. Die. funny when you die though it's just kind of like bloop and then you fall into acid or whatever crazy illegal chemicals they're making no whoa I'm getting my buttons turned around I feel like this should be over already what am I doing wrong come on die Doesn't this feel like it's going on forever? Maybe it's just me. Or maybe I just suck. Okay, that's embarrassing. You know what? Let's mess around with borders right now. <laughs> oh, that's okay. That's interesting. Who would have chosen that one? That's like the lamest border. Is it a cork board or what is that supposed to be? A desert? Oh, that's nice. You can pretend you're like getting some fresh air, but you're totally not. I used to like this one a lot as a kid because it was cute. <laughs> Can you imagine playing the rest of the game like that? That looks awful. There should be a thing called like the Super Game Boy Challenge and you have to make the colors look as screwed up as you can and you have to play the game like that. Because that would be awful. Oh my god, this one. Okay, see, I like the color scheme because it looks like a sunset and there's a lot of pinks and purples and yellows and I think it's adorable, but that looks like a mess. Like, you could not see what's going on. This is gonna be stupid because it's just gonna hurt myself, but should I try this one? All right, let's do this. Wow, this is bad. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not gonna leave it like this for the rest of the video. I just think it's really funny. Oh, cool, okay. So, did not know that was a thing. I just discovered. You can press X and it'll go back to normal. That's helpful because then you have to go through all that menu again if you're in the middle of the game. Good job, Super Game Boy. Come on, how many hits do you take? <gasps> Yay! Okay, that wasn't too bad. Hey, Batman. You know, nobody can destroy me. Thanks for the dramatic pause. It really added to it. <laughs> All right, back at Gotham City. Yep. Well, these are new guys. I might change the controls on here because I feel like backwards, hold on. But right now, I always want to switch the controls because I feel like I keep pressing the wrong thing. Let's see. Okay. Well, that's better. <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! Okay, never mind. I was gonna try to get those power ups, but I guess not. Okay, cool. I was like, am I gonna kill myself getting that? Because that would be stupid. But I was gonna say, well, okay, I can't talk while those things are dropping. <laughs> <sighs> it's 
sucked. Can I catch a break with the falling things? Damn. Whoa. I'm not gonna try to get that because I don't want to die. Do you think if you were a Batman and you had that thing flying around you, like, would it be like really disorienting? I would believe so. Well, now it's gone because they suck and I got hit. So. Okay. Oh, there's more than one. Okay. I was, <laughs> I was gonna say, oh, okay. I just had to dodge one of those. That's not too bad. Two, though, makes it a little more challenging. All right, so now we're in the Flugaheim Museum. Flugelame, Flugelame, Flug. I don't know. I'm just gonna stop now. Oh, okay. So these are a little more intimidating looking, a little. They're like machine gun transformers. Whoa! Dude, they're not messing around here in this museum. We are, we are ramping it up, aren't we? Okay, and now they shoot like different ways. Okay, I didn't know that. Whoa. Okay, it's ramping up. I gotta pay attention. Ooh, T, what does T mean? Guess we're gonna find out. Ooh, Ooh that's what it means. Ooh. It's kinda cool, I like that. Kill this guy. Ooh, I'm into this power up. Hopefully I can keep it. Is this like the... I don't know what that is. I'm afraid of that. I should look that up. I'm gonna be responsible and I'm gonna, you know, look something up. Okay, so Batman, Game Boy, power ups? Even though I'm pretty sure that's not a power up. So I think it's probably a wave gun. I'm gonna skip it because... I don't like the wave gun because I think the wave gun is what I would call the bouncy bullet gun <laughs> and I don't like it so that description appears to be what that icon is which I can't even tell what that is so I'm gonna skip it watch it's actually something good I'm not an idiot. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Yay! Okay, finally! See, this game isn't that hard, but it just gets tricky sometimes, and if you're not in the to in the right mindset, like, it can take a while. Oh, what are these guys? These guys are new. purpose right it just doesn't look like it's on purpose because it happened in two different places so I don't think it's as much whatever whatever oh great right at the door oh my goodness
Alright, so I think I figured out what I was doing wrong and it was a very stupid mistake. I forgot I have to like, shoot the door. Okay. That was easy. I'm an idiot. It's late. <laughs> Ooh, cutscene. Ooh. Batwing stage? What? Okay, I gotta get my bearings. I was not prepared for a freaking shooter. Oh, okay, so I just realized you can shoot forwards and backwards, so that might help a bit. Might be the keyword. This is making me think of like Fantasy Zone and stuff like that. Cute em ups. This isn't a cute mode, obviously, but... Oh, you can do both sides at once? Oh, that would have been good to know. Oh my god! Shit! Shoot, I feel like I was getting close! I'm not even looking at what I'm doing right now. Like, I'm just making stupid mistakes. <sighs> I hate this game. I don't hate it. I kind of hate it. I can't decide. But I really don't want to play it right now. Like, the feeling, like, of not wanting to do this is very strong. <laughs> oh my god, I'm frustrated. I don't know how to end this. So, on to other Batman games and other games. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Want to see more upcoming reviews and more playthroughs? Then don't forget to like and subscribe.